So today we are at our new Marine Aquaculture and Innovation Centre and we're here at Loch Fine on the Argyle coast to come and finally see our new facility and look at one of the first trials that's been undertaken. So the Make Centre is a partnership between Agri Epi Centre and Otter Ferry Seafish. We have jointly invested, supported by Innovate UK. We're an old established independent uh, fish farm and you're in the heart of the west of Scotland here. We're deep into fish farming country and our current species that we're farming are wrasse and lumpfish as cleaner fish and halibut. The Agri Epi unit's made up of 12 small tanks and six bigger tanks. It's sand filtered, UV filtered, it's a flow through system. We can capture the waste or any waste feed. This is a multi species facility that where we can work with uh, balan ras, salmon, or any other species. We can do trials with smaller fish in the 12 tanks in triplicate, so we can do four different regimes or diets and we can also take fish up to harvest weight. We've been involved in innovation and new species since 1968, but also R&D for other people. We did market research to see what was required out there. People can't afford to run their own research stations 24 hours a day for 365 days a year. So this is a good opportunity for the Scottish industry. It's one of a kind up in Scotland and what we're hoping to do is a range of trials and really look at the efficiency within the sector, really look at feed trials, new technologies, pharmaceuticals, validating and measuring change. We are doing a trial in benchmarking, so we are comparing three different diets in the market and we can find which one is behaving better or is more efficient. On land we've got more control, especially when it comes to doing trials. There's no background interference, you're not in a cage out there in the ocean. So the tank factor, or the environmental factor in a research unit like this one is minimized because we have the same lighting, we have the same flow, everything is more under control. So that is really important to run a proper trial. We're also looking at strain evaluation. So does one strain of salmon behave better than another? It could be a testing equipment for the industry, feeders, sonic counters, behavioral cameras. So the make facility here really does complement the other R&D facilities that Agri Epi has. We met up with Agri Epi, it was a good marriage. We were bringing the facilities and experience and they were obviously bringing their organisational skills and their innovation. So for me what I'm excited about is the range in R&D projects that we can now get involved with and the facility that we have here really opens up to more larger species but also linking in to the long-term sustainability of the sector and the wider ecosystem within that supply chain as well. Agri Epi Centre is the enabler of Agritech, both aquaculture and agriculture. And bringing these two partners together really will drive forward research and development within this sector. I think this unit can be a model for innovation, but with the background of sustainability, everything that we'll be trying to do in here is improving sustainability in some way. So we are going to keep improving the facilities and bring new species and new trials. It's a perfect combination to drive forward change. It's very exciting, but there's space elsewhere to expand and if the market's there and agri is there, we'll take the opportunity. So if you're interested in undertaking any projects, please reach out to agri Epi Centre and we can have further discussions and really develop a research and development project specifically for you.